Hello and welcome back to Bits and Bobs. Today's video is all about the 1917 sixpence from the reign of King George V, the coin we can see on screen now. I'll first go through the design of the coin and then move on to the facts and figures. So here we have the reverse design, featuring a crowned Lion of England facing out of the coin and stood atop the large crown there below. So two crowns and one lion, a very royal English featuring design. For the sides of the crown there we have the date, 1917, so of course the coin made during World War I. Around the main design we can see a nice ornamental border, a bit of a line border, below which we have the denomination of the coin, six pence, its value, and to the top there, part of the legend in abbreviated Latin, which reads, Fid Def Ind Imp, or in English meaning, Defender of the Faith, Emperor of India, in reference to King George V, who we will see now on the obverse of the coin. This is his one and only portrait used on coins during his reign, and it was done by Bertram McKennell. The initials BM for Bertram McKennell can be seen on the truncation of the king's neck. He faces to the left with no crown and no laureate. Around him we can see the legend, again in abbreviated Latin. This reads Georgivus V. Digra Rit Om Rex, which means in English George V, by the grace of God, King of all the Britons, listing his titles as king and as the monarch, and referencing how they believed back then that it was God's will for him to be the monarch and to be the king as God willed it. And around the rim we can see their small teeth, milling or beads, these feature on both sides to prevent the coin from being clipped. Now then, moving on from the design to the facts and figures. So this is a coin produced at the Tower Hill Mint in London, where the Royal Mint is based, between 1810 to 1975. The coin is composed of 0.925 silver, this is 92.5% of pure silver, or known better as sterling silver, for the composition of this sixpence coin. The weight of the coin is 2.83 grams, so a fairly small coin in terms of weight and in terms of size, as the diameter is only 19 millimeters, very slightly smaller than a modern penny for comparison. The mintage for this year is fairly low as well, with only 7,725,475 being produced, one of the key dates of scarce sixpences to look out for after 1900. The sixpence piece is of course worth sixpence, this is then one half of a shilling, which was 1 40th of a pound sterling, so there would be 40 of these coins within every pound. And back in 1917, its expense was equal to £2.17 today, so very similar or comparable to having a £2 coin today or a sixpence piece back then. And the coin was demonetized in 1980 after serving as a 2.5 pence piece for a short while after decimalization. Now then, moving on to the value of the coin today for a collector, it'll sell for around £12 in poor and worn condition, around £25 in fine condition, up to £100 in extremely fine condition, and then £200 in uncirculated condition. Of course, there, the higher grades being much more valuable, as fewer will have survived in the higher grades. So there we go, a lovely coin, some good history of World War I, and a nice design as well. So please do comment down below, do you have this coin in your collection? We'd love to know. And of course, as well, please do subscribe to the channel if you've enjoyed. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you again soon for some more coins in the future from Bits and Bobs. Bye for now.